Hello and welcome to the Home and Online Training Academy. In this video, we'll be highlighting common causes of input E105 on a BK150 FUE1. For the purpose of this demonstration, we'll be working on a V5030 SEL high speed door. Before we start, please ensure that the installation of your door is mechanically and electrically complete. The input E105 is displayed when the light curtain or grill is activated, but it can also display if there is a fault with the light curtain. The light curtain is connected through the snap 8 block and then through terminals 47, 48 and 49 on the BK150. 47 is 24 volts. 48 is the input E105 and 49 is ground. The light curtain comes with LEDs to indicate what active state they are in. There is a transmitter in one side and a receiver in the other. First, power off the door in the open position. To get the best view of the light grill setup, you'll need to remove the leg covers and canopy. You'll then be able to see the whole installation. From here, you can check if there's any damage to the guides, the legs, the leg covers or the side seals. You can easily inspect the bottom edge with the leg covers off. Check that the PVC end pieces on the bottom rail are intact and there's no debris hanging off them. The PVC end piece ensures the light curtain operates correctly. If one is missing, this can cause the light curtain to activate as the bottom edge passes through it. Power up the door and check what LEDs are shown on the light grills. In normal operation, the LED on the transmitter will be green and the LEDs on the receiver will be amber at the top with a green LED underneath. When you interrupt the light curtain, the amber LED will go out. If the LEDs aren't showing as expected, check the following to identify the problem. There might be a faulty or damaged cable. The cable could be plugged into the wrong location on the snap 8 block. It could be incorrectly wired in the control panel or there could be a problem with the control panel. It could be that the leg is out of line or that the light grills are at different heights. It might be that the light curtain is interrupted by a side seal that is damaged or loose. The light grills could be activated by dust, dirt or debris. It could be that the light grills themselves are faulty or damaged. Once you are happy that the light curtain is set up, power down the door and replace the leg covers and canopy. Once everything is back in position, power the door back up. Stand to the side that the transmitter is installed and look across the receiver without interrupting the light grill. The LEDs should now be correct. If not, it's possible there's an issue with the fitting of the leg covers and you'll need to make further investigations. If the LEDs are correct, run and test the door. Finally, run the door and break the light grill. The door should reverse to the top limit and give you the input E105. The door is now back into normal operation. Thank you for watching this demonstration.